across the country. Millions of people are working, shopping, traveling, attending sporting events, concerts, shows, and schools. They are enjoying the American way of life. Freedom may be at the heart of America, but some of the things that make the country great also make it a target for those who want to hurt us. Our federal, state, and local governments are working hard to keep us safe, but we all play a role in securing our public spaces. And we are counting on you to do your part. Pay attention, be aware. If you witness something that seems suspicious, don't rely on others to take action. If you see something, say something. How's your Janie? The biggest man-made threat to our public spaces are improvised explosive devices, or IEDs. IEDs are often small and easily transportable, with catastrophic effects. Hey, that's strange. What? This guy just walked up to that table, put a red bag down, and then walked away and left the bag. If you see someone leave a bag or package, don't touch it. Report it. Intentionally leaving bags or packages in public spaces is a potential threat, and action must be taken. Make the call. Cameras and recording devices have gotten so small that most of us seem to have one with us all the time. It's not unusual to see people taking pictures or videos almost anywhere. But surveillance and information gathering is a common practice used by terrorists prior to an attack. If you see someone trying to conceal what they are doing, taking pictures of exits, security, or restricted areas. If they hang around for no apparent reason, ask inappropriate questions about schedules or the facility, or if they try and avoid security when approached, make the call. Fashion may follow trends, but people always dress for the season. If you see someone wearing heavy or bulky clothing that is obviously wrong for the time of year, carrying suspicious bags or acting extremely nervous, they may be carrying explosives or weapons. Don't be a hero. Try to place a solid physical object between you and the threat. Stay low to the ground and call security or the police immediately. There was this really sketchy guy walking in the student center building. He looked like he was wearing something under his jacket. I, I don't know, it just really freaked me out. You have been so good all day long. Yes, Many of us work, visit, yes. or live in secure buildings with multiple entrances and exits. Oh, hey, let me get this for you. Although these buildings feel secure, we are all often guilty of letting people in when we shouldn't. Okay, baby girl, throw your purse. This may seem like the nice thing to do, but people trying to gain access to buildings without permission or credentials are suspicious. If you see someone somewhere they don't belong, make the call. It may be nothing, but some guy just snuck in behind me in my apartment building. People try and sneak all kinds of things into small and large venues. Ticket takers and security staff are there to stop illegal, prohibited, and suspicious items from getting through the door. Big crowds and open access events can make security challenging, and terrorists know it. Venues like these are prime targets for massive attacks. Terrorists may use trucks, vans, or cars to conduct surveillance or detonate an explosive device. Report vehicles that are left intentionally, parked in prohibited areas, or are left sitting unattended for long periods of time. It didn't feel real, though. Yeah, that's true. Don't ignore your instincts. Vehicles parked where they don't belong are a potential threat. Make the call before it's too late. The threat is real. We are vulnerable. 
when it comes to keeping our public spaces safe. We are all in this together. You have the power to make a difference. Why don't you call the police? I'm going to get our waitress. Miss? Something really strange just happened. Guy left this guy left a bag. bag. Be aware. And if you witness something suspicious, don't rely on others to take action. If you see something, say something. Make the call.